All right, folks, here it is. My four channel, count them, one, two, three, four channel tube mic preamp using a Bumblebee Pro RM6. Thanks, Artur Fisher from Latvia. And uh, the cool thing about this design is that it uses an external power supply, which is right over here. I built this, built and designed this. I'm turned away from the mic. Um, we've got two power switches. There's a power switch on the back there somewhere, which turns this light on here. We've got high quality, expensive bender connectors. And this is tethered to the back here. So you've only got DC connectivity between the uh, power supply and the preamp. Everything is very well grounded and the ground scheme makes this super quiet. You can see I'm at what uh, 57 dB of gain. We can turn that all the way up and pretty much all you're going to hear is just noise in the room. Got a ribbon feature on here. This bypasses the input secondary. Check one, two, three, four, five, six. Check one, two, three, four, five, six. It gives it just a little bit of an increase uh, in amplification and it changes the characteristic of the way the ribbon is loaded. Check one, two in the transformer. Check one, two. Check one, two going back. Phase inversion. Uh, Negative 20 dB pad. You can turn it way down if you uh, if you want to drive the input a little less. And of course, we got 40 48 volt phantom power. And when you go to the ribbon feature, it deactivates the 48 volt phantom. So if you know you're going to be using a ribbon mic, just go ahead and select it. You get all the goodness of the uh, the impedance and you don't have to worry about your phantom power coming on. So, also have instrument DI that goes direct to tube grid. Nothing in between it. Just straight, straight from the cord to the first gain stage. Uh, got a secondary secondary power switch here because I know a lot of people. You'll mount this in your rack, and then you'll have the power supply somewhere else. So if you want to be able to turn off just the tube preamp you can you could turn off just the preamp section and your PSU will stay on as long as you want it to uh, looking at the audio circuitry uh, coming from the input first we go to step gain attenuators I'm gonna turn a light on here so we can see a little better Whoa. Uh, we have stepped gain attenuators all of the input circuitry we're going into Jensen input transformers here. Gain stages with a General Electric new old stock 6072 vacuum tube which was designed for microphone preamps. Uh, then it goes to the stepped attenuator back to the second gain stage here and then it goes through a white cathode follower very similar to LA2A output um, using a new old stock General Electric 12 BH7 that comes out at low impedance to the uh, Jensen output transformers which these things sound killer and of course we're uh, going balanced out and uh, again talking about the noise situation with this you can take a ribbon mic which is susceptible generally to some noise and interference you can stick this thing right inside and there's no buzz, no audible noise. Now you go over to the power supply with this mic and you do pick up some noise. And that's one of the reasons for isolating the power supply. That way this thing is super silent. You can use ribbon mics and get a whole lot of gain if you need to. We've got 63 dB of gain. And uh, yeah, so this is the first prototype and I would like to start making some more of these, so um, maybe they'll be for sale soon. I gotta think of how much they're gonna cost, and maybe you guys might 
have an idea of how much you pay for one. So your studio needs this. Four channels of real honest to goodness tube preamplification. And of course it sounds amazing. So good day.